Hello and welcome to Toggle.io. In this video, I will demonstrate how to create and run internal and external analysis through Toggle. I already configured my device and added a simple dashboard and I will start by going to analysis. Here, click add analysis. Name your analysis and select the runtime environment. I'm going to use Node.js. There are also examples available that can help you get started. I'm going to write a simple analysis script to convert the temperature sent by my device from Fahrenheit to Celsius. First, I need to import the Toggle.io SDK package. Next, I'm going to add an asynchronous function called MyAnalysis with a parameter context. The context passed will contain information about the environment variables, the analysis token, and the function lock. When you want to see your logs, you can use context.log to view them in your console. I'm going to add an if statement that ends the program and logs that the device token variable is missing if a device token cannot be found. Next, to access my device, I can create a new instance of device that was imported from the SDK and I will then add an object called filter that will be populated with the current temperature information for the device. After retrieving that information, I can log it to the console and then add a new object that will store that information and convert the temperature to Celsius. Because executing the send data function might cause an error, I'm putting it in a try catch that will catch any exporting errors and log them to the console. Finally, I'm exporting a new instance of the analysis. The first parameter of the function is my analysis, and the second parameter, for an analysis token, can be added if I want to run the script on my own computer instead of through Taco. I will show you how to do this in a moment. Now in Toggle, you can load your script from your files or just paste it in. If I click Save and Run, my script will be saved and in the console, I can see the error message I wrote earlier, alerting me to the fact that I have not added the device token variable in an environment variables. To fix this, go to Device and click Copy Token. Once you have copied your token, go back to your analysis and paste it in. Once you have copied your token, go back to your analysis and add the environment variable. Next, I'm going to update my widgets variable from temperature to temperature Celsius. Now that I have finished my analysis, I can go to the device emulator and simulate sending temperature data from my device. However, if I recheck my dashboard, the temperature has not been updated and my analysis script has not run. To run my analysis script, I need to add an action. To do this, go to Actions and click Add Action. Name your action select the trigger and type of action.
I'm going to set my action to run any time the temperature data is sent. Now if I repeat what I did earlier, the temperature I send in Fahrenheit will be correctly converted to Celsius and displayed in my dashboard. To run this script externally, add a new analysis and choose the external option. Copy and save the analysis token and then add your environment variable as before. Next, go to your script and add the analysis token as a second parameter for the instance of analysis that you are exporting. Now open Windows PowerShell and check your version of Node by typing node-v. Navigate to the folder that contains your analysis script and type npm init. I will use the default package, so I'm just going to hit enter for every field. Now use npm install to install the Toggle.io builder packages. I'm now all set to run my script. After starting the script and sending new data in Tago, I can see the results posted to the console, and if I go back to my dashboard, the temperature has been successfully converted by my external analysis script. For more information about using analysis in Tago, visit our website and access the documentation. Thank you for watching.